measurement. Measuring centimeters and millimeters with a small ruler. Do you know what a span is? If you stretch out your thumb and little finger, then what you have is your span. Let us measure the length of this table using spans. First, a little girl will measure the table and then her mother will measure it. Little girl's span is three and a half spans. Mother's spans is two and one fourth spans. Why did the measurement change when a different person measured the table? That is because spans of different people are different. The same problem comes up when we use our body parts for measuring things. That is because sizes of body parts of different people are different. So, we need to use something that never changes when we measure things. How can you measure the length of this line? You will probably take a ruler and use that to find the length. So, you use rulers and scales to measure short distances. When you use a scale to measure a line, you will always get the same length. It doesn't matter if you use a different scale or a different person does the measurement. The answer will always be the same. Let us look at a scale properly now. You can see long lines with numbers 0, 1, 2, 3 written below the lines. These markings are the centimeter markings. On this scale, you can see markings up to 10 centimeters. What markings do the long lines show? Centimeter marks. Centimeter is written as CM for short. You can see there are other lines on the scale too. Let us find out what those lines stand for. Between the centimeter marks, there are smaller lines. Let us look at those closely. How many smaller lines are there between 0 and 1? There are 10 lines. How many smaller lines are there between 3 and 4? There are 10 lines. Between any 2 centimeter marks, there are 10 smaller lines. Each of these lines is the millimeter mark. How many millimeters are there in 1 centimeter? There are 10 lines. That means there are 10 millimeters in 1 centimeter. So 10 millimeters is equal to 1 centimeter. We write mm as short for millimeters. 10 mm is equal to 1 cm. How many millimeters are there in 4 centimeters? 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeters. Therefore, 4 centimeters is equal to 4 into 10 millimeters is equal to 40 millimeters. How many millimeters are there in 8 centimeters? 1 centimeter is equal to 10 millimeters. Therefore, 8 centimeters is equal to 8 into 10 millimeters, which is equal to 80 millimeters. Did you understand centimeters and millimeters? Great!